Hello, everybody. How are you today? It's me again, Judy, and asking you how you all are, and I hope you are all well. Do you know what day it is today? Today is the first day of April. It is April 1 of the year 2020. Now, today the, the video is about shapes. Shapes can be a lot of fun. And I have a friend who's going to help me. His name is Grumpy the Crocodile. And here he is. Say hello. Grumpy, will you help me today with the shapes? He says he will. Okay, now we're going to start. Here is the word oval. Grumpy, can you find an oval shape for me? Okay, look for it. Do you think Grumpy can find the oval shape? Let's see. Yes. He found the oval. Thank you, Grumpy. And we're going to put the oval there. Now we're going to look for a heart. How about that, Grumpy? You want to find a heart for me? Let's see. Grumpy, did you find a heart? Okay, let's see, Grumpy. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yes, he found a heart. Thank you, Grumpy. Here we have a heart. Now we're going to ask Grumpy to find a crescent. Do you know what a crescent is, Grumpy? Mm, he says no. Well, then try and look for a crescent for me. Let's see. Is this a crescent? Grumpy, do you think that's a crescent? He says he thinks it's a crescent. Well, I'm sorry, Grumpy, but that's not a crescent. It's a triangle. Oh, don't be sad, Grumpy. You didn't know what it was, so now you can try again, okay? Let's see. He's going to look. He's going to look. He's going to look. Let's see. Do you think he's going to find a crescent this time? I think he did. He found the right one. Very good, Grumpy. You see, you people can make mistakes. Crocodiles can make mistakes too. So let's put the crescent here. Now, Grumpy, I would like you to find a triangle for me. Do you think you can find a triangle for me? He says, he says, yes, because just now, remember, he picked up a triangle and I told him it was a triangle, so he definitely knows what a triangle is. Right, Grumpy? Here we go. And there's the triangle. Thank you, Grumpy. There's a triangle. See, a, a triangle has three sides. An oval doesn't have any sides, see? Not like a triangle. It's like a circle that's been flattened out a little bit. Now let's see, Grumpy, would you like to look for a circle for me, Grumpy? Do you know what a circle is? He said, that's right, Grumpy, that is a circle. Here we go. Thank you, Grumpy. Hey, Grumpy. You gotta give me the circle, Grumpy. Come on. Ah. Ah, he didn't want to give it to me. I think he must like circles. Now, Grumpy, I think I would like you to find a star for me. Can you find a star for me? A star is like what comes out at night. When, the, when it's nighttime, the moon comes out and you look up, you see all those bright little lights. Those are stars. Can you find a star for me? He says yes. Let's see if he was, if he got the right one. He did. Do you know the song about stars? Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. 
Grumpy, now I would like you to look for a diamond or a rhombus. This shape, people have different names for it. it. Sometimes people call it a rhombus and sometimes people call it a diamond. Here is a rhombus, the name, and here is the name diamond. Do you think you could find that one for me? Oh, you're telling me a secret? What secret is that? Absolutely right, Grumpy. That This shape also comes out in that song with Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star. Just a minute, find it for me and we'll sing it, okay? There we are. There's the rhombus. It goes like this. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the sky so high. Like a diamond in the sky. Absolutely right, Grumpy. That song has two shapes in it star and diamond. Let's see Grumpy. Now we're going to look for a shape that has eight sides, Grumpy. It has eight sides. Do you think you can find that one for me? Let's see. Let's see Grumpy. Did you find the right shape? He sure did. There is the octopus. To gone. And let's count the sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It has eight sides. You are absolutely right. You know what, Grumpy? You are an excellent helper. Thank you very much. Now let's see. We're going to look for a rectangle. Oh my goodness, do you think it's going to fit here, the rectangle? A rectangle has four sides, except it's got four, two long sides and two short sides. Let's see. Can you find it for me? Is this one it, Grumpy? Let me see. Let me see, Grumpy. Oh, Grumpy, I don't think that is a rectangle. This has four sides, except that the four sides are the same. You have to look for one that has two short sides and two long sides. Can you do that for me? Let's see. Let's see if you did it right this time. Let me see. Yes, you are absolutely right. See, it's got two long sides and two short sides. Thank you, Grumpy. You got the rectangle for me. And now we have one more, Grumpy. The one you just picked. The one that's not a rectangle. It is a square, Grumpy. It's a square. And it has four equal sides. Let's see, Grumpy. You want to give it to me, Grumpy? Oh, come on, Grumpy. Come on, Grumpy. Wait a minute, Grumpy. I'm going to tickle you. I'm going to tickle you. Oh, I got it from you, Grumpy. I tickled you and I took it away from you. And there's the square. Grumpy, shall we just help the children to repeat the words? Children, please repeat with Grumpy and me. Triangle. Crescent. Heart. Oval. Circle. Star. Rhombus or diamond, octagon, rectangle, square. And now I wanted to tell you something, children. With these shapes, you can make drawings and have fun with the drawings. Just look. With a triangle, look what you can make. You can, make, you can draw a tree with a triangle. 
With a rectangle, look, you can make a funny looking dog. With a crescent, you can make a moon. Look at the moon and you give him a nose and eyes and a mouth. With a circle, do you know what you can make with a circle? Lots of things. But I thought maybe you could make a sun. See, with a circle. With a star. Well, once again, you can do a lot of things, but I thought, how about a shooting star? Those are stars that you see at night, and they fly, and they have like a tail to them. They're called shooting stars. With, a, with an octagon, you know what you can do? You can, draw, you can draw a stop sign, like when you're driving in the car with mommy and daddy, and daddy has to stop. There's a sign that says stop, and those are octagons. With a diamond or rhombus, how about if you made a drawing of a kite? Look, a kite flying in the sky. With an oval, you could think of making a balloon. An oval-shaped balloon. With a heart, how about a lollipop? Mm, yum, yum. You want a little bit of the lollipop? <laughs> Grumpy, you ate the lollipop. Was it good, Grumpy? He says it was. And the last one is a square. Do you know what you could draw? You could draw a crocodile like Grumpy. He, see, this is Grumpy, and that's Grumpy also. With a square, you could make a funny looking crocodile. But you can make, draw many, many, many different things with shapes. So if you want, you can have fun, get paper and crayons or colored pencils and make shapes and have fun making shapes. And before I go, I wanted to tell you about the music you hear in the background it's classical music, and the composer is Chopin. And Chopin was born in Poland. So anyway, that's all for today. I wanted to now tell you to have a wonderful, wonderful afternoon and evening. Enjoy yourself and remember to be healthy, to be safe, and to be happy. Happy, happy. We love you. We love you. We love you. Bye-bye. Be happy.